Really and she's busy playing yeah. bubbles with Izzy because Izzy is doing some lovely things now. Yes. Izzy, are you doing ballet? Yeah. yeah. Tell me about your ballet dancing. Oh, you're going to show me? You're show, going to show us a move. Oh, wow. Man. Show me what you do in ballet class now. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm fairly close. Oh, wow. do, do your pointy toes. Oh, oh that's it. Look, you wow. see? You are just the best well, at ballet oh, dancing. Toes. Very outgoing, very happy child. Yeah. yeah. I mean, one of the, the things with the condition is that they're generally overly social. Um, wow. And all through all of the <laughs> Williams Syndrome children and adults, they have a huge affinity with music in particular. Wow, so I wanted okay. to... Singing. Singing, dancing, and um, some of our adults know. actually compose their Did own pieces, sing too? Uh, yeah. which is Incredible. fantastic. What song yeah. can you sing? Sorry, I'm interrupting. Sorry, you go ahead now. Can you sing us a song? Do you know any songs? What songs do you like songs. to sing? Mamma Mia. You sing it. Oh, Mamma Mia, yeah. Mamma Mia, here I go again. My, my. Absolutely. Let's bring in, because you mentioned uh, Fanula yeah. Tynan. Uh, Doctor, we we'll bring you in at this point. Now, we're not going to ask you to sing Fanula, because <laughs> he's definitely a better oh, singer. Ready sing. Are you ready to sing <laughs> the second verse of Mamma Mia? Um, obviously, Linda's telling us about Izzy's diagnosis and, and a treatment path, etc. Um, tell us a little bit more about what the, the group does in terms of support and help for each other. Well, I think it's really important, like Linda said, that you meet people who are in a, you know, the same boat, basically. So from my perspective, I'm a sibling. I have a 39-year-old brother with Williams syndrome. So in a way, um, I'm while still being a family member, I don't have the issues that, let's say, parents might have, um, which would be very specific to parents. So it allows me to be able to connect with a lot of the siblings, particularly the younger ones. So we do a summer school in Mary Mackillop College and um, we have the kids that come in for a week and we do, it's like a full day and we, we run it like a school actually. So we very much focus on educational interventions, 